is Miss Si Yu. So for today's art, we are going to color either a fruit or a vegetable. So in your package, you either have a vegetable or a fruit. Some of you have watermelon or carrot or pear or apple, tomato or a corn. So what I have is a watermelon. So I'm going to color wa my watermelon. So in your house, you can use markers, crayons. If you have paint or watercolor, you can use those too. So, or if you don't have any of those, you can just put some red stickers on it. Okay, so today I'm going to use red dot dot. And I'm going to color more seeds, make more seeds on my watermelon with a Sharpie. And I'm going to use a green uh, marker. So I'm using dot dot marker and a Sharpie. All right, let's make the art together. All right, seekers, let's add more seeds on the watermelon first. If you have a watermelon at home, you can add more seeds too. If you don't have a watermelon at home, if you have apples or corn or carrots, you don't have to add more seeds, right? All right, now let me use dot dot to color my watermelon red because there are some yellow watermelon, but the most common one is red, right? So let's do some red color inside. I'm using dot dot. If you have dot dot and you want to use it at home, make sure you press it down. Make nice big dots, okay? All right, so I'm gonna do this much right now. If, uh, when you do it at home, you make sure you color the whole thing. All right, so watermelon also has um, green peel, right? So I'm gonna color the peel green. Make sure if you have the watermelon at home, make sure you color in line. If you don't have watermelon at home, if you have other fruit and veggies, also if you're using markers, make sure you're coloring in the line. No scribble, scrabble, okay? Do you guys like to eat watermelon? I love watermelon. All right, so I'm gonna do half. Okay, so this is how we do the art today. We are going to use different material to color or paint or a fruit or vegetable. All right, bye seekers, have a great day. Thank you for your support.